If you want to take your PowerPoint project and turn it into a video file, it's actually really easy to do that. All you got to do, literally, um, I just opened up my PowerPoint. This is a school project. Um, all you do, literally, go to slideshow. I'm pretty sure this matters, but maybe it doesn't. If you go to rehearse timings, you can actually uh, go through the motions and tell it when you want it to switch slides, you know, and all that. I already did that ahead of time because when you're done, what happens is, is it um, assigns time to each slide. If you notice, 27 seconds, 15 seconds, 20 seconds, 26 seconds, blah blah blah. Basically, that would look like this. You know, and then you would just hit next slide. Well, you would just hit next slide to make it keep going. You know, whatever place you want. Just trying to use that as an example real quick. Um, you know, and then it asks you, do you want to save the times? You say yeah. Um, then after that, you just go to file. Save as. And then um, instead of PowerPoint, you literally just go drop down and click Windows Media. You can name it whatever you want, um, save it wherever you want, and then just hit save. One thing you'll notice though is it, it does take like, maybe like five minutes for it to actually convert. At least for mine, because mine was like a four minute pr presentation. Uh, you'll see it here in a second on the bottom. See right there, creating video. And then uh, as soon as it's done, like I'm just going to cancel that. As soon as it's done, we can go and find it. I'm just going to find it real quick. Notice the perfect video. Now the one thing I do need to say is if you're gonna uh, upload it to YouTube for some reason, uh, make sure you're not using the song. That could be copyright infringement because they'll block your video and make you put some whack freaking song in its place. Uh, you'll see that in another video I uploaded when I uploaded this one. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, that's how you do it. Pretty easy.